a bit of protein. Cynthia Arrington is meeting with her dietitian Kelly Hogan. The 53-year-old breast cancer survivor receives nutritional and wellness counseling at Mount Sinai's Dubin Breast Center. I'm learning that there are many ways to eat healthier and love what you're eating. A new study shows women who follow a balanced, low-fat diet with increased fruits, vegetables, and grains have a 21% lower risk of death from breast cancer. There are things we cannot control about breast cancer recurring or developing it in the first place. But the very, very interesting thing about the study is it shows us there are things we can control, things like diet, maintaining a healthy body weight. The study being presented at the American Society of Clinical Oncology meeting looked at nearly 49,000 postmenopausal women. One group adopted a low-fat diet for eight years, while the other group continued their normal diet. The women who ate low-fat were diagnosed with fewer breast cancers. A lower fat. Kelly tells patients to eat less red meat and processed foods and sprinkle in some healthy plant-based fats. Like olive oil, nuts, seeds, and avocado. Cynthia says while she was already eating very healthy before her diagnosis, she's never felt better. When I got diagnosed, it was, it broke my heart because I thought I did all the right things. I am just living more than ever now, and I'm excited about life, and I love life. There's a well-known link between obesity and breast cancer. The women who followed the lower-fat diet lost about 3% of their body weight. That and exercise are the best ways to lower your risk for breast and many other cancers. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.